the people who help out on our farm are considered family just because there's been people who have been helping us out on this farm that have been here before I was even born. You know, we have our family, but the whole community is really family to us. Every summer in between high school, I would always work on the farm. A lot of weekends I would do morning hog chores. We grew up here. We know what it's like to care for those animals. I remember almost every Easter, my sister and I would get up early and go do hog chores before church, just so our employees could have the weekend off. Yeah, we always went to church smelling like pigs. <laughs> My sister's very serious. I think everything's funny. We have two little brothers, so they're constantly calling us sassy because we boss them around. My dad used to always joke around, oh, there's the sassy sisters. My sister came to me when I was a sophomore in high school. She was in college at the time, and she's like, I want to start a business with you. It doesn't matter if you're completely ready for it, you just have to jump in. I constantly surround myself with other entrepreneurs who have the same goal to make a difference in the agriculture industry. People were constantly asking my parents for local pork. Um, they know that they live right next to a hog farm and they're like, well, we have to go to the grocery store and we don't even know if it's yours. Not a lot of people know about swine production and how pork is actually raised. So that was the main mission of us starting the business, that was my drive to make the time for it. We've just noticed that a lot of people from even more urban areas are just wanting to know the story behind their food, whether that's meat products or other, you know, fresh produce. They just want to know the story behind it. We want to be able to share with other Nebraskans that we're a Nebraska company that has Nebraska raised pork. We started this business about two years ago. Kenzie came to me and she's like, we need to call it Sassy Sister Swine. And I said, I don't like that name. <laughs> We're not doing that. But I think we argued about it for about three or four months and she got her way. So here we are, but. We do a really good job of communicating. I think that's the most important thing, especially when you're in business with your family. Kenzie and I work together really well, and I'm super thankful to have her as a sister. Uh, I wouldn't want to start a business with anybody else, so it's been, it's been good. 